Residents of the quiet village were shocked to learn that the remains of Mwendoa, who went missing in 2017, had all along been in the toilet. The exhumation was led by Muka police commander Jacinta Mirania and officers from the Directorate of Criminal Investigation. Kwa sababu meona tumefukua mafupa, ambaye ya 2017 iliwe kwa hapo. Now it's a matter of investigation. The exhumation opening old wounds with the deceased father, Michael Ndingu, recounting the pain they have gone through for five years. Jina naitwa Nicholas Musyoki Ndiku kutoka Enzai. Mimi nilipoteza mtoto wangu 2017. Na hiyo miaka nilikuwa naendelea na kumutafuta. Na nilimutafuta sana mpaka nikapata report na fununi mtoto wangu mahali alikuwa. Na ndivyo hapo tuko sasa. Na kwa sababu nilipata usaitizi kwa DCI na serikali ya Kenya Ninapongeza hao na ninasema wachunguze na mwalivu adhibiwe kulingana hila alifanya. Two suspects, Zimbi Mutungi, who was the deceased friend and his mother, have been arrested in connection with the killing. Sana nikuwa natafuta huo mutoto. Na wakati nilipata ripoti, mutoto tunaweza kumpata elia hii, tulisaitia na ndisi yae, mbaka sasa hivi tumempata. Na tumemutua mahali alikuwa na weko kwa choo. Uh, mal, 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 walikuwa marafiki walikuwa marafiki na hata walikuwa nasomba moja kuna shule walikuwa nasomba moja kwa hivyo huyu shirikani wao ndio sasa sijui walikuja wakosania nini huyu mmoja akaua huyu mwingine mtoto yangu na kwa sababu mtoto ni mtoto ndio sababu tunafuata kama wasasi the incident shocked residents who miled at the suspect's home after they saw police officers heading to the homestead and began digging their toilet. Wako kwa custody ni mama na mtoto wake. They are assisting us in, in, in investigation. Ambaye yuko na DCI hapa. Na diyo meona katika hii sin tumekua na daktari, tumekua na watu ya sins of crime, tumekua na pastors represented here. Diposa tuweze kujua ni kitu gani ilitokea wakati huo na nini rifanya huyu ya kamua. So far tukona hawa suspect wawiri kwa custody just to help us in, in investigation to establish the truth. The suspects are now set to appear in court reporting for Ibru TV and Beryl Shienzi.